Hello everybody and welcome to Clear Path Guidance and Tarot. This is your pick a card oracle message for Saturday, December the 21st. I am using the energy oracle cards this week and I would like you to stop and think of a situation that you need guidance on or a question that you would need guidance on or an answer to and then pick a card you are drawn to. Card number one, <clears throat> card number two, or card number three. I will timestamp it in the comment section so you can go straight to that card and then uh, receive the message rather than reading the, watching the whole video, okay? All right, I will give you 10 seconds to pick a card. If you need more time than that, pause the video until you're ready to pick that card. Otherwise, I'm gonna count to 10 right now. <clears throat> Okay, so card number one is appreciation. This card shows a woman holding a single rose. She enjoys the scent and beauty of the single blossom, yet around and behind her are bramble bushes. She could be focusing on these, worried that she might get caught up in their prickly branches of difficulty. Instead, she's pausing to experience the blessings of a single flower. The sun is breaking through the clouds, shining on her choice and on the tiny buds waiting to open up. This card upright is telling you that you have much to be grateful for and, like the flowering bush behind the woman on the card, there is more to come that you can't yet see. Congratulate yourself for every moment that you, you choose for every moment that you choose appreciation, this decision shifts your consciousness from lack to value, and it's guaranteed to bring more worth and richness of life to you. For those of you who pick card number two, your message is attachment. In the upright position, this card reveals that your passage forward is being stopped by strong attachments to old patterns or people from the past. The chain at your wrist is bolted to fear from the past or desperation about the future. Although you may wear the mask of pretense or even contentment, you simply can't seem to go forward. The stuff that's keeping you stuck could be physical addictions, emotional patterns, or even old relationships. Are you living in fear, addicted to old, unhealthy habits, or so desperate about the future that you can't be happy now? If so, the chains that bind you could be of your own making. This card is telling you that it's time to take the action you need to break out of your chains and move forward to an open, free, healthy, and authentically happy life. It may take some courage and effort to let go, but know that you are capable of doing it. Until you do, the difficult energy will just repeat itself, keeping you stuck. And for those of you who pick card number three, the message is, door to personal healing and happiness. This card is a harbinger of positive change. The beautiful light-filled door opens onto a lush, rainbow-lit spring filled with vibrant lotus flowers. Whether you're working on some inner healing, such as breaking an addiction or looking to make some external changes, such as finding a new place to live, this card signals that your life is opening up and new opportunities are about to appear. The changes you've been working on are ready to blossom with wonderful results. So make sure you see your personal intentions through with continued action and optimistic expectations. All right, everyone. Have a great Saturday. Bye-bye.